The traders, accompanied by Meru County Governor Peter Munya and Senator Kiraitu Murungi, marched to the British Consul in Nairobi in another attempt to stop the impending Mira ban by the UK. The traders currently export up to 80,000 tons of Mira weekly to the UK, a venture which earns them an estimated 1.8 billion shillings annually. The group has faulted the proposed ban as lacking justification, given that a department of the British government had already cleared Mira. It's a very, very comprehensive report, you know, which has done and reviewed all the literature on Mira. And it also says that, the, you know, Mira is not an dangerous drug. It even cites the WHO reports. Meru Governor Peter Munya has further dismissed any attempts to introduce laws that could change the status of Mira in Kenya. Nakanda has been doing seminars and talking, but there is no law. And it will, it will not fight its way in our parliament. In addition to alleged health implications, the UK is also keen not to be turned into a regional transit hub for Mira exports. For JSO at 7, I'm Bella Genga.